Rosa. What's happening? Where did all the lights go? It's dark. I'm scared. <gasps> the glow of his glasses. You saw that? <laughs> that is oh, ominous. that's ominous. Let's go. That's Kilo, all right. Confirmed. Y yes. Uh, yeah, yeah, confirmed. Yeah. <laughs> Nothing else needs to be said about that one. Confirmed. Epic arena. <laughs> Rosa holding up the ropes. Very courteous. Okay. Appreciate Kilo it. was lost. I don't yeah. know. Kilo, where's your controller? Kilo wanted the head to head setup rather than shoulder to shoulder. Oh, I see, I see. I love the shoulder to shoulder. Tradition. I like the head to head too, though. Like, mm. it's, it's very, you know, competitive. Oh, boy. And our final combatant in Grand Blue Fantasy versus Top 8 of CEO, please welcome Shulabu. It's dark. I'm scared again. Actually, I shouldn't be scared again, folks. Grand Blue Fantasy fans Ooh. at home should recognize this entrance here. Uesis. Is this character coming to the game or what? Look, there's a, if not before Nicholas, all right? Yeah. Don't or get Siegfried. Nicholas's way. Nope, Nicholas first. Well, no one getting in Shuabu's way on his way into the ring. And there appears <gasps> to be a bouquet of flowers oh, available to the go. crowd. But one is saved. And what could it be for? Is that... Is that... Paying respects Paying to the respects. death of Kilo. Kilo, not even having it. So, no, 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 no. Don't mess with me right now. Don't get in my way of this top eight. That beautiful and luxurious Herman Miller chair with its nice back support and lumbar support. <laughs> it's actually more of a gravestone right now for Shuabu's entrance as he leaves the rose. Well, there we go. We're getting the setup rolling here. Shuabu about to plug in. And is that one of them leverless controllers that you? It is. Dropping? It's the cross up too, right? So yes, we were just talking about the hitboxes. A clash of styles, of a controller type and play style. Yeah. And uh, of titans throughout this game's online competitive life, they've both been working very hard as well. They enter everything. Everything. Yeah, yeah you can definitely guarantee that if you're throwing an online Grand Blue Fantasy Versus tournament, you're probably going to see most of this top eight, right? And mm -hmm. uh, Kilo and Shubu, definitely two combatants that we've seen time and time again uh, as well. And seeing this run back happen here on the grandest of stages, I mean, the energy, palpable, right? The toss of the rose right there, you know, Shubu just already paying respects to the death of Kilo, but Kilo has something to say about that. Believes in victory, as it were. Yeah, it could be a little bit premature in a, in a fighting game match to declare it over before it starts. We'll see. You, you don't know, want to we'll stand see. up too early. Uh, it's the confidence, though, right? You know, top yeah. players usually exude confidence, and it's, you know, I was talking about this earlier on another yeah. uh, stream as well, too. Let's take a quick gander at this bracket and look at the confident players that are still left in this top eight. We've already lost two of our competitors, unfortunately, or one of our competitors, one mm. about to walk out right now. Yeah, I think Shuabu, you know, probably wants a shot up at Ren in, in winners. I think it would be, it would be fitting, right? Really Shuabu's been yeah. very helpful at uh, helping Ren around in terms of like, translation, localization, right. and hosting. But uh, when you're one against one in the CEO wrestling arena, there will be nothing needing to be translated. Yes. The game will do all the talking. Wants to keep the belt stateside here. Red mm. wants to guarantee another championship belt. But here we go. Ready to set up, send out the tweets. I guarantee Kilo's tweet is probably like, I can't believe Shubu just threw a rose at me. Shubu this is serious just business right now. Shubu actually threw a rose on my lap. I, where, I wonder where Dudley me on stage. Is that was a taunt? Yeah. Is is the rose now under the table? Is it on? It's the on the oh, table. Oh, I see it sticking off the table. Yeah. So I think it. maybe Kilo might like to take it as a prize and give it to somebody they fancy. You know. <laughs> that that's a you know that's a little well, takeaway from this, right? You know, everyone knows you're a hot commodity once you make winners or uh, make top eight in right. Grand Blue Fantasy versus top right. that's finals. True. That's and, true. I mean, climb all the way up to grand finals, and you will be the name echoing for at least another year until the next one. That, that is very true. Yeah. I mean, it, it, not true for Ren, though, because Ren is already back in this top right, eight, so right, let's right, continue. Yes. That's two two years. That's of, a legacy, yeah. It's a legacy at already. that point. Right, yeah. It's almost a saga. We get yeah. one more, <laughs> we'll have the full saga. Yeah. 
acts. Because that's how Xenosaga was three, so. Right. Colosseum. That makes get sense. to the hat trick. And they go straight to the Colosseum where they're most comfortable. No, uh, no, no dead knights in the background this time. <laughs> Perfectly clean and fair fight. Just sparring, you know. Absolutely. And here we go, folks. We have our last introduction of the loser side here. Let's get it to it. Shuabu up against Kilo. Oh, yeah. I, I can hear you back there thing. popping off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And they skip the intros. Violence on the mind. Oh, absolutely. I mean, you threw a rose at me. Disrespect. The Belial, though, believes in nothing but love. Kilo, after his switch from Grand, always played this red Belial color. I, I've always loved it. The blood kind of color matches his effect. Oh, and there's another whip punish. But not the largest confirmation. Shuabu taking advantage of the sides. Yeah. Really smart to back, so gain the distance. Doesn't have to deal with the Oki from six here. Wow, the deepest toe hitting dive kick. Shuabu takes advantage off it. Looking for a little walking shimmy, trying to make the throws. Nothing doing here, though. Two well frame grab. Wow. Plenty of for Shuabu. Yeah, immediately going right into the skybound art as well. This is going to be that grip. Nice. Trying to catch up, anyways. Yeah, just about people on lane. Broken the light lead. Well, great DP push up. Shubu, so without Nita though, having spent it on uh, rushdowns, back shifts, super, I mean, uh, Kilo uses rushdown right there, trying to get in, make something happen, a little block string, but now the cooldowns are basically gone. Yeah, he needs to get Asabodius. Okay, wait a minute, one touch away for death. There's the back throw here. The parry calls it out, and honestly, the most usage of meter that we've seen so far in this top eight with the new mechanics between rush, uh, overdrive, back shift as well. So great usage. Yeah. I mean, honestly, Kilo is definitely an early adopter of those mechanics alongside Shuabu as well, too. So seeing that utilization is absolutely tremendous here. Yeah, it gives you some hope when you only have 50 meter. Of course, you still build the meter faster by rushing the opponent down. As you Shuabu has a massive lead in the, or meter lead in this round already. Arriving at super, probably going to use it to try and confirm into a kill here. Chip's going to be relevant, too, and Kilo can't even activate overdrive yet. Not keeping up in the meter. Great air to air. No combo though too far for Asimodius. Here, Kilo. Yeah, I mean, gosh, it was a tall order right there. Not a height joke in the case of Belial here. Not being taller than Shuabu. Or, excuse me, six. six. Yes. yes. Even in a game with one button DPs, we still can't always anti our dive kick on reaction. Oh, but there's one button unique action counter. A great punish choice for Kilo against Shuabu's approach of choice. Okay, nice low check. Yep, loves to see people blocking it out in this game. It's not like you're taking a gray line or chip damage from the normals. Not until overdrive, anyway. Oh, great parry. Yep, parry is completely successful so far. Only has it worked. Wow. Yeah, wow, able to block the unique action from Belial here through the sky. Things can get a little bit messy when somebody blocks that in the air. Often the data is not really clear. Right. You can see that Shuba was still careful, though. Careful with the line, even with a kind of rush down character. And Kilo's still in overdrive, so pretty much any confirm. Could kill, I think? Even without, like, a... Yeah, just do have super available with overdrive. Yeah, that's true. All right, deep cross-up does get blocked here, and wow, what a bait on the parry. Able to follow up with the whip punish. Kilo's getting around on the board. Yeah, it was a very well-timed H. I think walking back, Kilo has an innate sense of when to punish the parry without having to react to it. Not just trying to look, but knows the timing automatically. And it works for throwbait timing, too, I think. And nice, how to hold the EX mill here, mess around and find out. Asmodeus coming through, got a couple low checks. Oh, nice DP. Nice. Hold this, please. Got another one coming for you, mess around. Go for the in your face overdrive, gonna get the guard crush. In your face because it's point blank, and it also feels insulting. Kilo taking a massive lane. Wait, with overdrive damage, he's gonna kill. No, no, not quite. Yeah, that would have been a grip. Yeah. Okay, overhead does get blocked. And great usage of overdrive, too. I mean, maximize the use of your meter, especially when you're at full health like that, too. Big call out for Kilo. Yeah, entering with DP, very clean. The unblockable guaranteed kill choice. Yes. It was equally one sided games, I think, for both of them. Right. You'd, we, we hope, of course, for round three and going the distance for uh, game three in a set that can only be three games. We'll have to see if it uh, slows down one way or the Believe other. In victory. Battle one. Engage. Right. Well, 
Well, opening gambit here, nice. Tries to keep things safe with the aerial pinwheel. Straight to the corner, delayed DP from Hilo. Great choice. Have you brought that one out? Knows to save your options all throughout the set for critical moments. Oh, the five L made contact, and that made the uh, throw whip, unfortunately. Okay, nice. Got the EX. I can push it over to the corner here. Uh, we're gonna see defense. Oh, oh it's yes. overdrive from overdrive for both players here, and unfortunately Kilo takes the L on that one. They're losing a grip of the overdrive. Second hit came through, and even more overdrive gone. Doesn't matter. The EX pulls through. Shubu getting the victory. Overdriving the overdrive. I feel like I've seen this interaction somewhere in another fighting game. It's like uh, you know the moon drive thing. Yes. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And of course the latter overdrive will always win. Yeah. Hold on, hold on. A couple checks to the close out. Oh, perfect timing on the far from Shubu. Well confirmed. And chasing the back shift. The first one that comes out, 0-1 on back shift. Yeah, you know what? Actually, I really appreciate the commitment from Shubu and the interaction there. We've seen it a couple times. The back shift has to get the room here with throw. Will get punished, though. That run speed of six makes chasing down no trouble whatsoever. But once you're in the Belial 2M prison, Shubu knows that you have to wait for a long time before you can force way up. Look at all those five L's that whipped against the invincibility of the overdrive. A great state for Kilo to be in to possibly tie up this game. Overdrive on overdrive action. They both have supers. They can kill on any counter hit touch, probably, even from an air to air. Okay, nice delay, got the EX there, trying to counter poke it. Nice 2L from oh, Kilo. that is not a super. Yeah, didn't confirm correctly, that's unfortunate. Right, the EX, Shubu getting another shot at life here. Nice block, no punish though. The block stream continues. Chip is just not a factor, it does nothing. Overdrive runs out though for Kilo, back to regular mode. Shubu with a huge advantage now in that case. Can still use overdrive. I mean, can still use super. Yeah, got a spot dodge here, nice throw. Finish. 2L frame wow. prep for Shubu. Takes yeah. it the long comeback through that round. 2-0, I mean, uh, and. Yeah, 2-1. 2-1, two, one, two, one, two rounds straight, I should say. Yes. 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 2-0 in rounds. Yeah, six is definitely the one to beat.